Hello again, everyone. I'm George Diaz with Office of the Lord Ministries, and I want to welcome you to this week's Pure Power Minutes presentation. Today I'll be giving you some good news and some bad news. Since the Lord knew that most people prefer to hear the bad news first, He gave us the following verses of Scripture in that order. In Psalm 34, 19, the bad news is that many are the afflictions of the righteous. The good news is that the Lord shall deliver you out of them all. In John 16, 33, the bad news is that in the world you shall have tribulation. The good news is that Jesus also said, but be of good cheer, be happy, be optimistic. I have overcome the world. And finally, in John 10, 10, the bad news is that there is a thief, Satan, who wants to steal, kill, and destroy you. The good news is that Jesus came so that you could have life and that you might have it more abundantly. I want to close with great news. It's found in Colossians 1.13. Paul writes that God has delivered us from the power of darkness and has translated us into the kingdom of his dear son, Jesus. Notice that that's past tense. You may be living on this earth, but you are already a citizen of heaven. Like any citizen of any kingdom, you have the right to be protected by its king and his angelic army. Enjoy the fullness of your heavenly rights found in his gospel, in his good news. No more losses.